Hey everyone, and thanks for jumping back into the Cryptoverse. Today, we're gonna to talk about Bitcoin, and we're gonna be discussing what if Bitcoin had the market cap of? If you guys like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and also check out the Telegram channel, which you can find a link to in the description below. Let's go ahead and jump in. So we've done this before with altcoins, right? And the nice thing with altcoins is you have Bitcoin and Ethereum to compare to. And so you can just say, well, what if one day an altcoin had the market cap of Ethereum or if it had the market cap of Bitcoin, where would it be? Not that I expect an altcoin to reach either the market cap of Bitcoin or Ethereum, but the idea is if, if an altcoin ever did reach the market cap of Bitcoin and Ethereum, the assumption would, the, that would be that Bitcoin and Ethereum's market cap would be several times higher by that time, okay? So this shows the top assets by market cap. And you'll notice... You have gold at number one, Microsoft, Apple, Saudi Aramco, Alphabet, which is Google, Amazon, Silver, Bitcoin, Tesla, Meta, which is Facebook, Nvidia, Berkshire, Hathaway, and so on and so forth. You could actually see Ethereum is down here at number 15. So go ETH. Now, what we should talk about is I believe, I believe that this cycle is the cycle that Bitcoin has a decent chance to flip all publicly traded companies, okay? So, you know, we're likely gonna get back above silver. I think Bitcoin will likely flip Amazon and Alphabet and Saudi Aramco. Now getting up to Apple and Microsoft, it becomes iffy. Maybe we'll flip them, maybe we won't. It would also depend on, on what Apple and Microsoft do. I mean, we know these market capitalizations are not, are not fixed. Right, I mean, Apple can go up, Microsoft can go up. You can see that Bitcoin's current market capitalization is a very modest, and I mean modest, 1.277 trillion. Apple is at 2.468 trillion, and Microsoft is at 2.53 trillion. I don't know when Microsoft flipped Apple, but it happened at some point. Um, and, and the interesting thing is, what if Bitcoin had the market capitalization of these other assets and you can see gold is way up here at a not so modest 11.607 trillion okay now from here what we want to do is we want to do a price analysis what if bitcoin had the market cap of these other assets so let's let's go look at that now all right so what we're going to do is we are going to switch this over to this if bitcoin had the market cap of what price would Bitcoin be? Now, it is not lost on me that the supply of Bitcoin is, is not constant. I mean, we know that the, the circulating supply of Bitcoin will go up. I mean, of course, there's only ever going to be 21 million Bitcoin, but there are more Bitcoins being mined. Okay, so I understand that. But let's, let's just say if Bitcoin had the market cap of these other, of these other um, assets today, where would, it, where would its price be? All right. So when I made this video, Bitcoin is actually at 66.3K. You can see how quickly times change because now it's actually trading over, over $67,000. Now, if I, had, if I had the same market cap of silver, it'd be at 73.1K, all right, 73.1. For Amazon, 93.5. Alphabet, 104.6. So in order to flip Alphabet, which is Google again, Bitcoin would need to break 100K at the current valuation of, of Alphabet. Saudi Aramco, 105.6K. Apple, 130.5. Microsoft, 133.8. And finally, gold, 613.4K. That is where Bitcoin would have to go to flip gold. Now, I know some people are, are very optimistic and think that, that Bitcoin can flip gold uh, this market cycle um, within the next few months or so. Uh, I, I, I really don't think that's going to happen. I, I think that those predictions um, are, are a little bit too optimistic, uh, <laughs> to say it one way. Are they possible later on? Yeah. I, I mean, if you're asking me, will Bitcoin ever make it to 600K? Yeah, I think it will. I mean, I I think it's only a matter of time. Remember, time is on our side. So leave something for next market cycle, right? I mean, hopefully we'll flip, you know, we'll, we'll flip silver, which I mean, I, I mean, we, we already did at one point, I believe. Um, 
Hopefully we'll flip Amazon, Alphabet, Saudi Aramco, Apple, and Microsoft. We'd like to flip all those, but are we gonna flip this one? I don't think so, okay? So maybe this is the market cycle where Bitcoin flips all publicly traded companies and silver, maybe next market cycle, maybe, well, it, it remains to be seen, but maybe it'll be the market cycle that flips gold, but even that will be uh, somewhat of a tall order. Uh, but it, it is possible, right? And I think a lot of that will depend on how high Bitcoin goes this market cycle. If Bitcoin goes to 200K this market cycle, then we'll have to we'll have to say, all right, well, it is possible that Bitcoin could, could flip gold next market cycle. Of course, remember too, though, gold is not constant. In five years, you know, I mean, the, the, the price of gold today, I believe, is just over $1,800. So in five years, for all we know, I believe the last time I looked at gold, it was it was around 1824, right? 1824, um, and I think it was like up 0.04 percent on the day. So I know some gold gold holders are in fact getting out of bed for that. But I think, you know, in five years, maybe the price of gold instead of being 1824 could it be 1826 or something crazy, um, something insane like that. And if that's the case, right? If that's the case, then then this value would change for, for, for what Bitcoin would have to get to. But you, you get the idea, right? You get the idea. In order for Bitcoin to flip gold, probably gonna take it, uh, probably not gonna happen this market cycle. So this market cycle, hopefully will flip silver and all these publicly traded companies. Maybe next market cycle, we conquer gold. And then the market cycle, market cycle after that, maybe we conquer the world. But we have a long way to go. Hopefully you guys like this analysis on if Bitcoin had the market cap of. If you guys like the content, make sure you subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and also check out the premium list at intothecryptoverse.com if you want to know how I'm navigating these markets. Thank you for tuning in. See you guys next time. Bye.